Robert, thank you for opening up the doors of uh, this great studio again. Uh, we love you and, and all the gals and guys that work with you and uh, what all you're doing out here and what you have been doing. Thank you for having faith. Thank you for having faith in this state and staying here knowing that we were going to get this done. Um, Bobby Jindal was in town yesterday doing a little run through and, and, uh, and I told him, I said, Bobby, guess what? All those movies you've been having over there in Louisiana, they're going to be coming to Texas. Yeah. Rightfully so. Um, it is a... Don and I were just talking about the, the power of, of this industry and uh, even during the Great Depression there was one uh, industry that continued to grow and, and uh, you know part of that uh, may have been just to take people's minds off of the things that were going on around them in the, in, in the 1930s when the economy was turned down and, and I said, kind of like now? And, uh, and, but the point is, I think this is the timing of, of this piece of legislation is really important to, uh, to Texas and obviously to, uh, to the film industry and the passage of, of, of this House bill uh, is a very important step in our process of continuing to create an environment in this state where people know they can come and risk their capital and have a good chance to get a good return on investment. and, and uh, keep more of their money and there's a reason that Texas has home to more than fortune 500 companies in any other state there's a reason we're the number one exporting state we're the reason that over 80 percent of the jobs that were created last year in America were created in Texas and some of those reasons are sitting right here behind me and I want to say thank you One of the things I, I greatly appreciate about our local senator is he totally gets it about economic development. Uh, uh, senator Watson is a great economic development senator and, and, and his focus back when he was mayor and head of the chamber and now as a senator and he, he's never lost the, uh, the, the interest and the passion to create the, the, the environment where people want to come and you know I mean everybody wants to live in Austin. I mean, I mean come on. It's, that's easy. But when you have the economic reasons to come and live here, uh, Senator West will share with you that there might be a little place in South Dallas of a, of a uh, the, the movie industry could take off and do great and extraordinary things. In San Antonio and Houston, uh, we have such great environment in this state where uh, we can go and and, and, and use so many different venues across this state for the, for the industry. And, and, and this legislation is going to strengthen our in, in investment in what I consider to be a very vital industry and it shows off our state to the rest of the world. Uh, people all around the world are beginning to find out what we knew all along, that Texas is a great place to live, to uh, have a family and to, to grow a business. And, and it's not just the jobs that a studio like this is going to create, but it's also those game studios and the small businesses that support the industry, that, you know, the jobs that crop up on the advertising side, uh, you know, the employers who support uh, the, the commercials that are going to be shot all across the state. Uh, the moving images industry has brought over $1.2 billion into this state over the last 10 years, and I will promise you with this piece of legislation, we'll blow that number away uh, in the next 10 years. So my hope is that we give people who want to live here already even more incentives to come and they don't have to go live in places like Michigan or New Mexico or Louisiana. No offense, of course, to those fine places. <laughs> but uh, I also want to thank our friends over at the Texas Motion Picture Alliance who are here with us today. Thank you. <laughs> Brother Don Stokes. Don's been a, a great leader in this effort and, and uh, 
you know, whether you're a director like Robert or you're a programmer in a game studio somewhere up in Dallas, or for that matter, you're a, a caterer on a commercial shoot in Houston. You're all very, very important part of this moving image industry in the state of Texas. And we just look forward to uh, the role that you're going to continue to play. And, and uh, we're going to move Texas to the top of the credits. Uh, you know, if, if, if you're a member of this industry, um, I encourage you to really learn about the, 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 the program, learn about what this piece of legislation is, is created, and, and put it to work. Um, <clears throat> go to the Texas Film Commission's website. It's www.texasfilmcommission.com. And, and get to know what the guidelines are, get to know how they apply so when you're out talking to your friends in the industry or you're somewhere else, you can share with them exactly what it is that uh, they have to, to, or we have to offer. And, and, and the next, I encourage you to utilize it. Utilize the program, post that call sheet, call your investor friends in Hollywood, summon your second director back from Ontario or wherever in the heck he or she is and, and get to work. Um, and finally, let me say to uh, Donna Dukes and to uh, Senator Duell, my great thanks for them and their professionalism, their enthusiasm, their passion uh, for this industry and for their legislative work. And so join me in thanking them just one more time for this great presentation.